Software and Media Player. Another essential part of the video wall besides the monitors is the software. This includes functions such as the distribution of the image information to the various monitors, the processing of the content and the integration of external data. With the content management system you can also create time playlists, exchange motifs and update content immediately. The media player. The media player is an additional component of the installation. The choice of the player is hereby just as crucial as the additional components themselves because it sends the signals to the screens. An important aspect that is to be considered in this connection is the resolution. The media player has to be capable of a resolution of at least UHD when considering video wall that is 2x2, to be able to play in full HD resolution on your video walls. Additionally, the surroundings of the installation should be considered. Depending on the video conditions, the player should be heat and cold resistant. As a rough orientation, it should be in a place of operation under 30 degrees Celsius and enough air circulation should be presented so that the cooling system works. Players that are professional grade can sustain the heat of up to 40 or 50 degrees Celsius without problems. If the video wall is meant for 24-7 operation, the media player will need to be made specifically for that. Generally, the media player should come pre-installed with the needed software. This makes commissioning considerably easier. However, so-called Blanco players are used if the software is already in use. Since this is pure hardware, additional costs may arise for the necessary consultation and installation of the programs. At this stage, it is important to consider that the software and operating system are compatible. The player could use Android, Windows or Mac for example. In order for the software to be recognized, it has to be usable on the chosen operating system. Our recommended player is of course the Vineo 4K signage box. System on a chip. SOC devices are another alternative to media players. These are screens in which processors with the corresponding software solutions are already installed. Thanks to the integrated solution, operating costs can be reduced by low power consumption. An advantage of the SOC device is the easy installation. Most of the media players require to be plugged in externally and therefore also require their own electricity plug. SOC devices, however, do not require any additional wiring. Depending on the location, the media player must also be accommodated so that external brackets may be necessary. This decision, whether a SOC device or an external media player will be better depends on the project. In terms of flexibility and deployment scenarios, however, the player offers more possibilities and computer power than the system on chip screens. This is especially the case with video walls that are based on 4K content or interactive elements. Additionally, the player can be used for different presentations, which shows a higher flexibility. The possibility to influence the capabilities between player and software is void with the SoC. That makes the system change or upgrade difficult to a degree of having to purchase new screens. The ordinary stronger processors and graphic cards make the media player the better choice, especially for complex video wall projects.